All right. I'm here. Consider it done. I think I fixed everything here. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Every time I play that game, this game, I thought that said it leads away to a, a rock fence. Ooh, I'm excited. Oh fuck you! Time to turn this one. <laughs> See ya. Ooh, uh, let's get that. My Pankadin's twin axes. Kill him. Time to turn this one to the size. So much damage. <laughs> oh, he does eight by default hit. That's also really good. Oh, my, my mage is leveled up. Oh. Hmm. Spells are kind of not great, honestly, but mm. well, next one drain seems on, on well. I want to give, I want to make her the uh. Level two doesn't do anything. Give the word. Watch this. What's a chicken? Oh. Oh. May the Death gods come for you. Watch you and deliver. Like I can't, I don't even have to do anything. You would do ah, well to clear a woman's and deliver. Something amiss? What do you want? Ah. You would do well to clear a woman's wrath. Your time draws near. I'm off. Your doom is at hand. in my party was the best decision I've ever I could have possibly made. Like oh boy. something wrong. Consider it done. I'm here. Take care of it. Something wrong? Your 
Doom is at hand. To arms! Watch this. I'm here. I'm off. Give the word. What do you want? I'm off. Oh, is it doggy? Oh. Something wrong? I'm off. Oh man, I might as well check out this place. It's like what? We're getting the BE. Doctor Who. Oh. Hi. I'm here. Oh, well, this guy doesn't. I'm off. Like, oh, yeah, I guess. He doesn't seem to care about us. No. <laughs> you serious? What do you want? Something wrong? I'm here. Watch this. My quick loot seems to be put in the screw. Let's see if this worked right. It did. Excellent. Um I don't remember what these are. That's a shield. I know that's a shield. Neither of those matter. Let's know the cloak. What's the cloak do? We don't know. I summon you. Oh. Give the word. Well, I suppose we are in a house. We're not rest of the sun. What? What do you want? No. Oh. I'm off. Okay, now tell me what this is. Oh, a cloak to armor and saving throws plus one. Okay, that's good. Let me know what this does, but it's still pretty good. Who could use it more than me? I love how these guys are even now because of their uh, level and stuff. I think the bonus AC will be important for him. Next he gets a bonus it's AC as he levels up, so something wrong? No. I'm no, off. Thank you. But Sonic just kill someone, dude. <laughs> Someone. I just think it's really hilarious how I just don't think he's killed anybody. Oh, well, 13 kills. Okay, he's doing good. Let's see, what about you? 7 kills? 22 kills? It's gonna be all of them. 25. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> 15. Oh, we're distributing pretty well. I'm actually. here. Consider it done. That. No axes are good. Gems are also good. Oh, we'll learn this. Illusion spell. Give the right. word. What do you want? Consider it done. 
I'm on it. Something wrong. Consider it done. <laughs> what are you doing in the closet? Oh, the, oh no. Oh. Okay. See ya. I'm here. She does have a shield right now, but the single weapon could be pretty good. Well. Let's just do, we'll do that. Oh, he's pretty close, close to leveling up too. Give the word. Consider it done. This is the end of the zero woman's wrath. What do you want? I'm off. Watch this. Watch this. I'm off. What's up, dude? <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Killed all his friends. But he don't give a fuck. I can respect that. Against wall. That's not a good idea, dude. Hmm. Oh. Consider it done. I'm gonna figure something out for him. Maybe someone will know a way to help him out. Watch your back! Name it. I'll take care of it. Something. Yeah, okay. I do, actually. You know, why, why do you either of you have a drink this potion, my friend? Something wrong? Something Ooh. amiss? Immediately. Time for some action! My Clankadin's twin axes! <laughs> Can I help? Uh. May the gods have the I'm here. Not the best of healthy. Yeah, I'm here. Yeah, I know you're not. You're about the health. I'm gonna die. Give the word. Your time drops. May death come for you. you. Death comes ah! for you. Okay, no death, so that's good. I'm off. I'm listening. Ooh, new weapon proficiency. Saves, that's good. Hmm. 
O2 AC, big boys. Back what do you want? I'm off. Something wrong? Vita Mortis Watch this. Oh. Don't give the word. Ooh. Consider it done. What hand. do you want? Have at me. I'm off. Please don't kill anyone. Thanks. That was well. Oh, those are probably magic arrows. I mean, what am I saying? They're like definitely magic arrows. <laughs> Can you identify these yet? No. You can. Cool. AC 10 at level 3. That's am fucking believable. Something wrong? I'm yeah, here. You're hurt really bad, dude. Vita Mortis. Give the word. What do you want? I'm off. Let's just roll. I'm just getting late, though. Watch play. this. Shouldn't be, though. Two o'clock in the afternoon. It's not Watch that time this. yet, but... I guess we can just go. I mean... We finished this pass here. Pretty straightforwardly, no one died. That's good. That means it's an improvement. <laughs> and I found out that Sonic is doing a lot more than I thought. He's just he's very subtle now. Plus he has great armor class, and so that's good. Oh my god, the art is so good. Alright, well. Fighting their way through the goblin-infested valley of the pass, the survivors of the doomed East Haven expedition at last came upon the small hamlet of Kaldahar. Nestled within the roots of a massive oak tree, the tiny cottages were a welcome sight for the weary travelers. As the party approached the town, a warm breeze blew over them, chasing away the chill of the frozen pass and carrying with it the sweet scent of cooking fires. Neat. Alright, well, um, we can just keep going, I guess. Consider it done. A short episode so far. Hello, buddy. Hey, Nate. How did you know we make it? Uh, who? Okay, we'll go talk to him. Sounds cool. Thanks, friend. Oh, equipment. We can sell him things, maybe. Here's some gems. I'm off. What do you sell? Oh, cool. Okay, let's, uh... Mummy's tea. Oh. Well, I'm getting a lot of bard, I guess. So here, buy these some stones. That's <laughs> like all we got. Zero. He's worth more than zero. Something wrong? Thanks, buddy. Consider it done. Oh, a mage tower. Oh, God. Consider it done. Hi.
So. Oh. You know, I like him. Consider it done. I want money, I want spells, I guess. Did he sell level two spells? Are you selling level one spells? Yeah. I want him to have identifying magic missile for sure. Oh, what are these? Okay, capacity. Resistance damage. Bonuses to opening locks and stuff. Wow, that's really good. 10,000 gold, uh, makes sense. F Charisma, oh. <laughs> that's what friends does, I knew that. Oh, bag of holding. Neat, okay, well. Could use some more spells, my friend. But you don't suck as much as he does right now. That's not true. I wouldn't mean it. Get that on here. I'm here. I'm off. I'm off. Okay, I should to find Arendelle. I'm off. It must be this place here. You said three rocks, right? Yeah. Expecting you for some time now. That's the enemy. It's yes, the name. I am Arendelle, known to some as the Archdruid of Kaldahar. Though I invite you to dispense with the formalities and just call me Arendelle, plain and simple. Titles tend only to serve one's own vanity and aren't really of much use in this small mountain community. Okay. So what's going on right yes. here? It was I who sent Hallister to East Haven for help. His death weighs heavily upon my conscience. For not only was he a student of mine, but he was also a friend and trusted companion. He will be missed, as will Rothgar and the other members of your expedition. You know about that? Oh yes, I know. I also know that it was no accident. Someone or something did not want your party to reach Kaldahar alive. Mm. There are malevolent forces at work in these mountains. Forces that seek to undermine the delicate balance we druids have struggled to preserve for centuries. What do you mean? No, oh, what did I could? The face of the evil remains hidden, but its presence is unmistakable. All about us, there are signs of its damaging influence on the balance. The unnatural weather, the recent rash of abductions, the numerous monster sightings in the pass. These all point towards something sinister. Even the animals sense something is amiss. I can only tell you of what little I know. Which disturbances would you have me speak of? That's weird that there's abductions. Oh, yes. Terrible, terrible. At first, there were tales told by travelers of companions disappearing into the night, snatched up from their bedrolls as they camped along the narrow trail that winds through the pass. We did not think much of these tales, for such occurrences are not unheard of in these mountains. Then one night, Conlon's boy, Sheemish, went missing. Sheemish. The next morning, the whole town searched for the boy, but turned up nothing. He was just gone, vanished without a trace. Weird. The boy was just the first. Several nights later, another disappeared. Megan Potts, the local midwife. Her husband, Khalil, was grief-stricken to the point of madness. With barely a word to anyone, he snatched up his sword and marched off into the darkness after his wife. No one has heard from him since. And now, the abductions are occurring more frequently. Aiden, the old innkeeper from the Evening Shade, was taken only three days ago. Hmm. 
Well, what's the deal with this? I fear that if we do not soon discover the source of these disturbances, then all that we have worked for will be destroyed. The evil that has come to these mountains infects this town like a disease. As its people suffer, so does the tree suffer from the sickness that attacks the balance, corrupting it with its very presence. Already, the circle of warmth that radiates from the great oak has begun to recede. We were forced to abandon the outlying farmsteads as a result of the shrine's fading power. If we do not take action soon, I am afraid that the life-giving warmth will cease altogether. Both the great oak and the town nestled within its roots will die. This must not happen. We need your help. Sounds good. I suggest you begin by investigating the Veil of Shadows. It is a place not far from here. Darkness has always clung to the floor of the small canyon, as if the light of the sun itself were wary of the place. There are a number of ancient crypts hidden within the shadows of the Vale's narrow cliff walls. There have been rumors of the dead awakening and emerging from their dusty tombs to walk once more amongst men. If these rumors are true, then I suspect that whatever is responsible for disturbing their slumber may be behind the other disturbances as well. Hmm. Go to the Vale of Shadows, learn what you can about the happenings there, then return here and we shall discuss a course of action. Good luck and farewell. Okay. Consider it done. Watch this. I think we can call it there then.